I am finally home. The devil thought he had me. Oh, what a run. Y'all, I'm so happy to be home. That was probably the worst trip I ever took. <laughs> like no cap but i'm glad i have the experience i know what to expect once i'm on the road i know what to expect once i'm out there like you know that's like the longest trip that i ever did ever next up getting on somebody's flight so yes y'all i'm finally home and i am excited oh i did not do an intro hey y'all what's the tea welcome to rain so banjo if you are new to my channel i said you subscribe before you leave don't forget to hit that notification bell so you will be notified when your banjo boy posts another video and if you've been here before girl what's up now i'm about to do what just about every duval person does when they touch down the town getting them screets y'all i am so hungry i did not eat anything and it is past 3 p.m okay um, I think I woke up around 11, maybe 12. I was really tired, y'all. We didn't get to Savannah until like 2 o'clock this morning. Um, a very long road trip, and I'm just so happy to be home. So when I was in Savannah, I tried this place called, I think it's 305 Wings, I think it is. Ooh, if y'all from Savannah, Please correct me in the comments, but I think it's called 305 Wings, and I had some um, garlic parm, and I had some garlic parm wings, fries, and a tropical lemonade that was Friday. So on my way back to town, I was just thinking about them dang on garlic parm wings, so I'm about to hit up Canal Street, straight from the 904, and get me some garlic parm we, I am going to see y'all in a little bit. Who's about to unpipe? <laughs> Not me. But I'm about to go ahead and get in these streets. I'm going to throw on a shirt because right now I have on one of those 50 cent tank tops. Y'all remember these G-Unit tank tops? I wear it because of the, the girls. It, it helps. It helps those sit right. Wait, that's the conversation for a whole nother day, y'all. Don't, don't, don't do that. <laughs> yes, sir. I have my food. Y'all ordered a 10 piece garlic parm wings. Breaded, fried, extra crispy with the sauce. My mouth drooling. Excuse me. <laughs> Some curly cubes and in a canal roll. <sighs> now this is what I'm talking about. All right, y'all. Let me mute this. I'm done eating. Hence the toupee. <laughs> I'm done eating. I still didn't unpack yet, but um. It's about to storm outside. I'm about to take a nap. I was sitting here watching this movie, PPP Long Gone on Tubi. It's pretty good. I'm only 19 minutes in. But um, I think I'm going to just pause it and take me a quick nap. Don't I look it? Look at me. <laughs> look, stop. But no, for real. I'm about to sit here and take me a quick nap. And um, let me turn on this fan because I'm a little hot. And I'm going to get up. And I'm going to treat myself to a spot day because I wanted to do that over the weekend. But I'm going to do it today. So I'm going to create a whole little vibe. I'm going to get up. I'm going to clean up. And then we're going to have ourselves a spa day. So I'll see y'all when I get back. Oh, and hopefully by the time I wake up, my package is coming. I came home right on time to receive some Amazon packages. I need to give myself some rest. They bubble never travel out to a new scene So that brings them up in loose jeans and so now we got you stuck inside of the crossroad I actually respect that you and never want more things Just two things, always tie your shoes when they're loosening Remember go outside and catch a drip because one breeze can make it grow Oh, what's inside of this loophole? I'm here for you I'm here for you, here for you But that ain't gonna kill for you Left it all behind right up on the hill with you Now it's common time, got the newest curse issue now it all makes sense, you prefer to blame me So your rep won't drop and blend with the lower class And broken ends, newsflash, you're what we call a broken trend ah! I need to give myself some rest Can you heal my curves? Can you take my mind away? I need to give myself some rest Body 
for your bourbon, playful sparkles and eyes. What a night like, watch me the table when you can sit down. Whoa, 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 whoa. I need to get myself some rest. I can't see forward, giant colors sweating when they see my car with the watermark. That self-care segment was everything. In addition to self-care, you know your boy love to eat. And y'all know that I love beef. I've been trying to find something that helped with my digestive system because we all know that, you know, the body, it takes a while for it to break down beef. And you know, you can be a little irregular. And your boy found the perfect remedy. Thanks to Bellway, of course. And I want to thank Bellway for sponsoring today's video. Bellway is a natural fiber supplement powder that promotes healthy digestion, made with organic psyllium husk and real fruit. If you're not familiar with psyllium, it is a natural fiber powder that gently travels through your system. This is a natural and healthy detox mechanism that promotes a healthy gut, less bloating, improved heart health, regularity in the restroom, weight loss, and healthy skin like mine. I've been using Bellway for at least a full week and I absolutely love the benefits of this product. They also have convenient traveling packets for people that are always on the go. If you have any weight loss goals, healthier skin goals, or just want to regulate your digestive system, Bellway is perfect for you. It's even perfect for my fellow keto dieters. In the description below, I provided a link and a discount code to enjoy 20% off of your first order at Bellway. Shop today and enjoy. Period. I want to show y'all some of the things that I had got from Amazon. Which one I'm gonna show first? I got it all laid out. <laughs> So the first thing I wanted to show y'all, I had purchased a new tripod. I already put it together because I used it for my self-care um, segment. Now this is from Sunpack Travel Smart 50. It's just a smaller tripod. It's kind of like the smaller version of the one that I already have that my camera is actually sitting on now. Um, I thought this would be perfect for like when I do my cooking segments, I can actually have this on the countertop. Um, so it can get a great view of me while I'm cooking because a few of you guys ask can I start like showing my face and talking as I'm cooking so I'm just trying to you know find different things to work with y'all anything I do really I can just sit this on the countertop or on the desk have it out and boom boom bam you know it'll be perfect when I purchased this you guys I definitely had y'all in mind I sent a few comments asking you know can you interact with us while you're cooking while you're doing this while you're doing that so Definitely had y'all in mind when I purchased this. Next up, y'all remember that little drama that I had with my car and the dang on dent, and I purchased some <laughs> dent poppers. Now, the dent poppers that came were these right here, okay? I'm a little ashy because I just got the bath, but these are the dent poppers, right? But this is what I needed. I needed this size. See? See the difference, y'all? <laughs> We knew this wasn't gonna do no damage. We wasn't gonna, we wasn't gonna let that, you know what? I'm laughing because that part of the video was hilarious because I knew it wasn't gonna work. But yes, this is what I needed. I needed this size and we're gonna try it later on to see if it work and if I can pop that thing out. Now, a few of y'all told me to use a plunger. Some of y'all told me to use a, um, a blow dryer. Some of y'all told me to boil some water and throw it on there and I knew the blow dryer wasn't going to work because I don't have a long extension cord to take all the way to the dang old car outside. Um, the hot water thing, I don't know. I didn't try it. And the plunger, girl, no. <laughs> so I'm going to use this. If this don't work, I'm going to use the plunger remedy. 
which one of you guys told me to use in the first place so we'll try it out and lastly i purchased just a cool neck pillow um this was from amazon as well so y'all know your grub will be catching flight soon we're gonna make banji international okay <laughs> and i needed me a little neck pillow now tiktok said now tiktok say your girls be wearing it wrong apparently you're supposed to wear it like this but i don't like that i don't like that Ooh, this is giving me oh this is giving me beyonce renaissance wait wait a minute hold on now because when the renaissance album come out i might gotta you won't break my soul you won't break my soul oh yeah this is giving renaissance okay yeah yeah show a little cleavage yeah this is giving it's giving july 29th it's giving vogue okay <laughs> but yeah this is that pillow no no but for real this is okay let me stop <laughs> if y'all catch my last vlog when i was in virginia beach i had caught some girl scout cookies these right here the toshier i opened these up just to try it with y'all so i never had this before it is french toast inspired cookies dipped in delicious icing and full of flavor in every bite so the concept is french toast so it's in the shape of a toast how cute and then the icing is kind of brown so of course i'm thinking this is like a cinnamon icing or a maple icing let's try it out These are good. If you try these before, comment below. And it's so crazy because anytime I buy Girl Scout cookies, I either buy the um, caramel coconut, the caramel coconut delight, the thin mints, or the shortbread. This is giving me shortbread vibes, but with like a cinnamon or maple icing. Yeah, that's cinnamon. Because it kind of reminds me of a cinnamon toast crunch a little bit. That's cute. Alright. Well, I'm going to go ahead and prepare some dinner. I'm a little hungry. I didn't eat anything all day. And I'm really, really hungry. I'm thinking about cooking some roast beef. Like I just told y'all, I'm like obsessed with beef. Like I love beef. I love steak and roast. That's just me. Did I grab some greens? I grabbed some greens and some rice. That's what I'm gonna cook for dinner. So let's go in the kitchen and get everything started. I'm trying to get dinner set. Cause it's a little late in the afternoon. This is some pot roast. I have some mixed peppers on the side with some onion and garlic. And I just fried it on both sides. I'm gonna run some water in it. Pop it in the oven for about three or four hours and it should be nice and tender. And I'm gonna make some gravy. All right y'all, so here's the roast. It's just about finished. Like you can actually go through it with the spoon. Yeah, so I'm just gonna add some diced potatoes and baby carrots to it. Let it boil for a little bit. Make some gravy and I'll be ready to serve. I actually need to start on my greens and rice and dinner will be complete. Sensational. Got the greens going. Y'all, these are turnip greens. I made just enough for me, honey, because I'm going to tear up this whole pot. Y'all know I am obsessed with greens. I freaking love. I have the turkey pots in there doing its thing. You know how it is. And if you guys are wondering, like, what I use for seasonings and how I cook things, I have 
tons and tons of videos explaining what I use and you know how long I cook everything so make sure you just look in your search bar Ryan So Banji cook with me and those videos will pop up and now I just need to make some cornbread and yes yes my pound cake cornbread that y'all been coming for me about talking about something that ain't no cornbread it's pound cake period it's good <laughs> and yes I use Jiffy cornbread cuz who gonna check me Jiffy cornbread mix Two eggs, milk, honey, vanilla ashtray. I don't 